Hey, I'm Andrew Gash for Audioholics, and these are the Energy Veritas V5.1 bookshelf speakers, and they are, bar none, the most beautiful speakers that I have ever seen. Uh, now, they also come in a uh, gloss piano black, but the samples that we have here, these are the piano rose nut finish, and as you can tell, they are pristine in terms of both the veneer and the gloss coat. Now, everything about these speakers screams high-end, and yet they only cost $400 each. Now, is that pocket change? Well, no, but it's still a far cry from what a lot of people would consider to be high-end. And a lot of the audiophile speakers that we've seen in our day, they don't even approach these in terms of styling or build quality. Look, let me break this down. Yes, the styling is great. They look great, but that, that's just the beginning. This speaker is a two-way base reflex design. Inset within the front baffle is a custom brushed aluminum inner plate. It unites the one inch aluminum dome tweeter with heat sinked neodymium motor and the five and a quarter inch Kevlar woofer. The woofer is shielded and has a real phase plug and a ribbed elliptical surround. Energy positioned the tweeter close to the woofer to create a near seamless origination point free of lobing effects. In terms of performance, the Veritas V5.1 has a frequency response of 50 hertz to 25 kilohertz, plus or minus 3 dB. It also has a sensitivity rating of 90 dB at 1 watt, 1 meter, which is uh, really efficient. On the back of the speaker is a port, which can be stopped with an included foam plug in the event that you have them close to a wall and want to reduce the base output. The box dimensions are 13 by 9 by 6.5, and that's a respectable size for a bookshelf, with enough room to handle some really low bass and yet small enough to take on a diminished look in any decor. The weight is around 12 pounds each. Connecting speaker cables to the Veritas line is easy. On the back, you'll find a pair of nickel-plated five-way binding posts, and you'll also find a standard 3 8 inch threaded insert for hanging these things on the wall. Now, for the best sound, we recommend putting them on speaker stands and showing them off, preferably without the magnetic covers. I mean, you're going to cover these things up? They're beautiful. I don't think so. So what do you do with a pair of speakers that are nearly perfect? <laughs> well, you give them to me, right? Okay, no, that's not what you do. But what we did is we decided to tear them open and see what was inside. So when we took off the plate that was holding these five-way binding posts, we were greeted with ample stuffing and a high-end crossover constructed with air core inductors and electrolytic caps. Now, these speakers, they are built like a tank, which is probably why uh, they sound so good. I mean, these are the best sounding bookshelf speakers that we've tested in a year. The Veritas V5.1s live up to their name because they put forth a truly accurate soundstage and a truly flat response. In fact, they just melt into the background. You don't even notice them. And they are free of the distortion or boominess that you might get from other bookshelf speakers that aren't built to play low for real. These speakers are quite possibly the best value on the market today. Still not convinced? Well, listen to this. The Energy Veritas V5.1s come with a five-year manufacturer's parts and labor warranty. And if that doesn't push you over the edge, then perhaps you should start looking for a different hobby.